Hi everyone, today I want to show you how to cook Greek style fried squid. This morning I went fishing with my friends John and Ken and um, we caught some squid here in Sydney, Botany Bay. So I prepared these already so I basically I put them in some olive oil, lemon juice, oregano, chili and a bit of garlic and I've cleaned them of course so you remove the in insides and you also take the legs off but you can get your fishmonger to do that for you but basically what you do is you get the hood of the squid okay we get a knife and we sear it just finely across the top here that's going to prevent it curling up or so they say so as you can see it's it's, it's cut there um, it's been marinating in this for about two hours now you can leave it overnight and we've got a hot pan with olive oil on here and we start off with the frying process. You don't cook this very long because if you cook it too long it's actually going to toughen up. So as you can see it's starting to want to curl but because we've cut it it's preventing it from actually cooking over. Now squid, calamari, I don't know if people call them, I get mixed up but basically this squid um, was caught with a squid jig, so while we were fishing this morning, we were actually going for kingfish and we caught these for bait, but they're so nice to eat, why waste them? And they're a delicacy actually. So as you can see, the oil is quite hot. I'll let it keep on frying on this side. Now, I'll give you an example of the legs. So the legs, you just cut the bottom half of the body off. And let's see, they're very thin. So these are cooked quite quickly. Legs tentacles. Again, octopus I know. It's a leg, squid, calamari, I'm pretty sure they're called tentacles. But I just want to grab this guy here and flip him over now. So you can see how it's gone nice and red. Okay, again remember when you cook squid, calamari, do not overcook it because it'll get to the point where it's inedible. So let me continue. This shouldn't take too long. It's a bit windy as well, which isn't helping us. This is summer in Sydney this year. It is terrible so far. Bushfires, smoke, and no sun. Okay. This is a big squid, so it's been cooking for about four minutes. Um, the last so we've probably cooked it in total for about six minutes. Now, being this large, I've been turning it around regularly to try to get it to cook on this side here where the, the wings are. But I think this is pretty much done. Okay, so I'll take this off and the legs are definitely done now. But depending on the size, so this is a large one, if you get a smaller one, you don't have to cook it as long, of course, the smaller one will cook a lot quicker. Um, this will be something that you can easily put on a barbecue. I've got a couple of the smaller ones here, which I'll cook in a second. But let me give this a taste test. I'll um, start with this end here. So it's still quite uh, nice, okay. So as you can see, it's firm, but not too firm. It's absolutely delicious. A bit of pepper, a bit of lemon, a bit of salt. Take it onto the table, and it's absolutely fantastic. Subscribe, watch my other videos, and um, catch you at the next video.